Welcome to Concept Guru. Learning is fun. Hello everyone. Today we are in one more session from Concept Guru where we are going to see about addition of four digit numbers with carry over. So let's quickly recap about what we know already about addition of four digit numbers. So let's say we have the number as 3 8 7 Six plus two one two three. So if we have to add these two numbers, first, what are we going to do? We are going to put them in their respective houses, like ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands. Correct. Now we will start the addition. First. we will do addition in the ones digit so 6 plus 3 you can use your fingers 6 plus 1 2 and 3 that is 9 then 7 plus 2 is 9 then 8 plus 1 is also 9 and 3 plus 2 is 5 So the total is five nine 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 five thousand nine hundred and ninety nine, right? So we already know this. Now, what if the addition of a particular two numbers is more than nine? Then what do we do? So that is what we will discuss in today's session. So before we proceed, make sure you have your notebook, a pencil. and an eraser with you okay quickly go and get it while you go let me write down the numbers that we are going to add so we are going to add two numbers the numbers are 3 4 5 6 plus 2 8 9 and 7 so let's try to add these two numbers so what is 7 plus 6 so 7 plus 6 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 that is 13 can i write 13 here no so the result is 13 7 plus 6 is 13 So I will write the ones digit in this place, and what happens to the tens digit? That will be a carry over in the next number. So three is here from thirteen, and the one is a carry over here. So now we have to add three numbers: five and one and nine. So let's do it first. Five plus one is six. Plus nine: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It is fifteen. So again, how do we write fifteen here? We will write five. But what happens to the one? you're right one goes here as a carry over okay so let's write the one here now we will add these numbers again so 1 plus 4 is 5 plus 8 5 plus 8 is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 is 13 again 13 so we will write the 3 here and what happens to the 1 you are right the 1 comes here so now we have to do 1 plus 3 plus 2 so 3 plus 1 is 4 plus 2 is equal to 6 so our total is 6 Three five three. 
Now let's take one more example. This time our numbers are 4, 8, 7, 6 plus 3, 7, 6, 4. Let's try to add these two numbers now. What is 6 plus 4? Let's try it out. 6 plus 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. It is 10. So, 10. How do we write it? So, the 0 will come here. And the 1, what happens to the 1? The 1 is carried over to the next house. This is the 1. And the 0 comes here. The 1 comes here. Okay. So now we have to do 1 plus 7 plus 6. So 1 plus 7 is 8 plus 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. So it is 14. So we will write 14. Okay. And the 1 of 14 we will write here. That is called carryover. So now 8 plus 1 is 9 plus 7 is 16. So we will write 6 here and again the 1 goes here. So now 4 plus 1 is 5 plus 3 is 8. So our result is the total is 8 6, 4, 0. Now, let me give you two sums for your homework. Please note them down and you can practice them. I will give the solution in the results. So please make a note of these two sums and practice them at home. Your sums are 3, 7, 6, 9 plus 4, 1, 2, 3. This is your homework number 1. Okay. Please note it down quickly. 3, 7, 6, 9 plus 4, 1, 2, 3. Done. Now, let's take another homework. This will be our homework number 2. It is 4, 7, 1, 8 plus 2, 1, 9, 3. This is your second problem. Okay, quickly note it down. 4, 7, 1, 8 plus 2, 1, 9, 3. Now, one more. Let's take the example. Another homework. Okay, it is 3, 1, 2, 7 plus 4, 9, 8, 6. This is your third problem. Right? So do these additions 3, 1, 2, 7 plus 4, 9, 8, 6, and you can compare the result in the description. Okay? So that's for your homework. Keep learning and see you in the next video. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Press the bell icon for our latest videos.